officials welcome back to a whole new video welcome if you're new if you are new here welcome to my channel if you are don't forget to subscribe it will help me out a lot it will help my channel grow and for my returning subscribers thank you guys so much for watching thank you guys so much for tuning in thank you for returning and without further ado I'm just gonna jump into the video I'm not gonna try and be too long in this video but we are here we are speaking about what well, I'm speaking about my current favorite some of the things that I've really been currently loving some of the things that I've been using constantly so I kind of wanted to share that with you guys y'all know this is a sharing channel and I feel like it's October I've al I always do October favorites weirdly um, but for these for this favorites these are things that you can always give somebody or even things that you can look to put in a goodie bag or I don't know or just buy for yourself like if it is that you're interested in purchasing any of these items I'll definitely recommend I will leave all of them links in my description box below so you guys can always check those out but without further ado let's get into this video I can't wait to share with you guys things that I've been loving things that I've been reaching for constantly since like September September is long gone and so yeah so without further ado let's jump into some of the items that I I have been favoriting or some of the items that I've been currently loving for the past two months so yeah let's get into it so the first item that I'm gonna share with you guys is an item that I hauled here already in one of my vlogs so if you don't watch my vlogs I would definitely recommend that you watch my vlogs because sometimes um, I put some good finds and stuff like that in my vlogs ever so often so if you aren't watching my vlogs I'll definitely recommend you guys go check those out but one of the items that I'm going to share with you guys is this Touchlearn hand sanitizer as you guys can see I didn't I haven't used a lot of it but I feel like a little goes a long way and I've literally been trying not to use it just spraying my hands all over simply because what I like about this, it is a power mist and it really doesn't make your hands feel dry at all and I really, really, really like that because we're not about, my hands are already dry, I have dry cuticles and I'm happy that I ended up getting this because it really did not or has not dried out my hands to the point where my cuticles look atrocious. So the next item that I'm sharing with you guys and basically this item is literally done. So... Um, sharing with you guys the oil to eradicate dark spots now in this little package or this little bottle here it's an oil that I bought from bush bomb um, I would definitely recommend if you're someone like me and have issues with like your, your underarms being dark or even between your legs being a little bit dark because of shaping I would definitely recommend that you guys try out this bush balm oil it's very very cute I think the lighting is too light for you to even see it um, but it's just called the Bermuda oil I think is what they call it they also have a scrub as so I have the scrub and the oil but the oil is basically done and I am in love in love in love with this thing I will say a little does go a long way but I'm a heavy-handed person regardless of whatever so a little doesn't go a long way for me I need to put a lot and I would definitely recommend if again if you're someone that have like dark spots that you can try this out I only use it for about two to two, two to three weeks and I love the results I have not re-upped on it as yet but I am looking to re-up on it this time I'm definitely gonna get more than one because I don't live in the States and it's just easier for me to get it in bulk maybe even three it retails for about $40 and I will definitely recommend if you guys are on the market looking for something to lighten up your armpits like myself that you can buy this I know there's other things that you can use to do that and my armpits were, were lightening up but the product that my waxing lady gave me it really burnt out my armpits i don't know what is in that product but it really burnt out my armpits so although it was working it burnt out my armpits and also it, i felt like when i stopped using it my armpits got back dark so i'm just like mm -mm. so i would definitely recommend this this helped a lot and it was lightening up my armpits i just need to continue using it and be consistent with it so if you are in the market looking for something even if it is not for your armpits you can use it between your legs you can use it on any dark spots that you would like it's an oil and you could and it's a very moisturizing oil too so I would definitely recommend alright guys so the next items that I'm gonna share with you guys is gonna be some more um, body items um, I guess I have a lot in this 
video but the next item that i'm sharing with you guys is the victoria's secrets coconut milk and rose it's a conditioning body oil with coconut oil and when i went into the mall yeah i hope you guys can see it but this is basically how it looks and it does have a lot that comes inside of it and i really like it because it's very 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 moisturizing for me it's very moisturizing for my body i actually bought two of these so if you watch my previous vlog you'd probably see that i w i bought two of these or i don't know it will be coming up in a vlog maybe on my previous vlog you would see that i bought two of these so the one i'm showing you the full one <laughs> So yeah, so I really, really like this. I'll definitely recommend this. I actually prefer Victoria's Secret's body mist and their body oils and stuff like that over Bat and Body. Bat and Body. I'm tongue-tied. Um, just because I just like the fragrance. Their fragrance is what I like. It's not too, too sweet. Next set of items that I got from Victoria's Secret was the Coconut Milk and Rose. This is a 24-hour moisture whipped body butter with sheer butter wow that's tongue tongue full it's a full thing but this is basically um how it looks hopefully yes so this is basically how it looks i also think that this is it smells the same as the body oil um i like it it's really creamy it's very moisturizing that's what i love about it I also feel like this is something that I can just walk with when I'm traveling um, or I could just put in my bag and I'm loving body butters lately I feel like personally they're more moisturizing rather than regular lotions um, and I think that that's the purpose of a body butter to be a little bit thicker and to be more moisturizing and I sometimes need that because sometimes my skin is just so dry although I've been drinking like I drink a lot of water on a daily and I think that this is a cute little two cute products that you can give to someone for the season you definitely can gift someone this um i think it's just cute and it does really smell good like it smells so so good i would definitely 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 recommend that if you guys are in the market for a new body butter something pretty affordable and a new body oil if you are into body oils i'll definitely recommend you guys check out victoria's secrets Alright guys, so the next item that I'm currently loving is another body item. This is a lot of body items actually, um, but we move like, those are the things that you use more often any which way. Um, so yeah, but the next item that I'm currently loving is, is this perfume that I got from Floral Street. I actually got this when I went to Sephora. I was in Miami about two to three months ago and I kind of think in one of my vlogs i told you that my girlfriend put me on to this when i said that the girl smelled good the girl smelled wonderful and it, what i liked is that it lasts a long time this is basically how it looks um it is a small little tube i like it i don't know if they have this in a bigger version um i haven't researched the company that much to see if they have like full sizes but this was a, this was a bit expensive i think this in itself is 34 us dollars like a four us dollars um and then i am um, i use it very sparingly or sparsely can i say that because this is it comes in this small thing and i really don't want it to finish um, but I would definitely recommend if you guys are in the market and looking for a really nice perfume, something not too big, or you even want to start off your perfume collection at an affordable price, I would definitely recommend that you guys try these. I think they have other kinds, um, but this is the one my friend was wearing, and so I just got the one that she was wearing. When next I travel, I'm definitely going to see if I can get like two more of these, because like I said, I don't use things you little little i like to spray all over and yeah i'm extra so <laughs> definitely would recommend again i got this from sephora i think they do have a website and everything so i will probably leave their website and also the link to this item i also feel like this is a good item that you can give somebody for the christmas season i know it's one small thing but a little goes a long way and i feel like even for traveling this comes in perfect because i don't now need to walk with like a perfume and put it in my bag i can just have it in my checked in bag like this is gonna this is working for me at this time like i traveled one time after i came back with this and this is what i walked with so 
yeah all right guys so the next item that I'm currently loving I actually got from Sephora as a birthday gift and it is the Tatcha rice wash it's a soft cream cleanser so I really really like this um, I have been trying not to use this a lot but I like what it does with my face it's the soft cream cleanser so it doesn't overly dry my face out and of course you guys have already seen me speak about the dewy skin cream and I got this from Tatcha as well and I have been using this this I have been using and I've been trying to use it little but you already know me I not that person I will put a lot on make sure my, it gets on my face my face is well moisturized and so I am gonna get these in bigger sizes or I might just continue to get the smaller versions because I think the bigger versions are a bit pricey but we'll see I will probably do a Sephora haul when I re-up on these items but I do think that these items if you are in looking for new skincare products to try I'll definitely recommend you guys try Tatcha it's really really good like this this moisturizer it's so good so the next item I'm going to share with you guys is about, is it going to be all lips? We're going to speak about lips. So one thing I needed to say is that I have very, very, very dry lips. And one of the things that I don't like is that the fact I have dry lips. And it doesn't matter. People always say, don't you drink a lot of water? Yes, I drink a lot of water, but my lips are still dry. And someone told me it could be the toothpaste that I'm using. And I believe it's probably that, the Arm & Hammer one. But nonetheless, I like, I like it. So I feel like I need to moisturize my lip. So... I have been using this Laneige. I hope I'm pronouncing it correctly, but it is their lip sleeping mask. I use this every single night, like clockwork. When I wake up in the morning, my lips feel rejuvenated. All of the dryness is gone or it's peeled off. I really, really love this. Will definitely recommend this if you're looking for a sleep, in, a sleep lip mask. And if you're someone like me, that have very dry lips although you drink a lot of water i really do think that you will love this so definitely recommend this the other lip product that i'm going to share with you it is from laneige i hope i'm not in this properly and it is their lip glowy balm in grapefruit you guys have seen me haul this in a vlog as well i am in love with this thing this thing right here cannot do me any wrong like I am so happy I picked this up by accident I'm happy that I got it because I really 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 do love it in the day in the night it moisturizes my lip when it says a lip glowy balm it's a really good balm and so I'm definitely once I travel or once I do a Sephora haul will definitely be re-upping on this um it seems like a it goes a long way and it lasts a long time so yeah so if you're looking for a good lip balm I would definitely recommend you guys try this and the next lip balm that I've been using as well and I've been using the summer Fridays lip butter balm this is also very very good and moisturizing I actually like this as well so I've been using the Laneige I hope I'm pronouncing this correctly so I've been using these two very interchangeably um, based on what whichever one I pull for but I would say I do prefer this but again it has to do with how dry your lips get and this also works for me but I think I reapply this a little bit more faster than I would reapply this and that's why I probably prefer this one but this as well is good because I was using this before I even got this one and it was giving it was working wonders and like I said I use them interchangeably they two the two of them are in my bag at all times so whichever one I pull for I will be mad at that so yeah and the final items I want to share with you guys are some mini bags that I got when I traveled I traveled to Dominica and went to the land store in Dominica which was pretty affordable at the time and I got myself this cute little bag so this is it I think I shared it in one of my vlogs um, on my previous vlog but this is it and this is how cute it is I just find it to be the cutest little thing and it does hold a lot of stuff and you just zip it like this and this is how the inside looks quote unquote it gives in it gives me pencil case vibe but honestly it does hold a lot of stuff and this is basically how you wear it and I just like it I love it I walked with it on vacation two, two times I went to, on vacation before this video 
so yeah i would definitely recommend i also got it in a white if you know me you know i love 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 these bags i've been pulling for them ever since i have gotten them and so i definitely wanted to share them with you i don't know if i can link this bag to any website or anything like that because sometimes when you go into these stores it's just like one-offs but I don't know if Shein has something very similar and you guys can check it out. They look very, very, very great with outfits. So yeah, just wanted to share that with you guys because these are things that I am loving. And that is basically it for this video. These are all of the items that I have been loving for the month of September and also the month of October. And I know I'm going to continue to love them and use them just because they are my go-to products. They have been my go-to go -to products for over 21 days. So yeah so i will talk to you guys in my next upload thank you thank you guys so much for watching i will try to leave all of the items that i mentioned in the description box below and i also feel like some of the items that i mentioned their skincare their body care these are things that you can gift people we should start thinking about gifts because christmas is coming <laughs> and so i hope this video is also very informative on on that i know sometimes people love big gift items but i'm personally a believer of you know if it is that you want to get everybody something you definitely cannot buy big expensive big ticket items for everybody and so these small little things here put together with lots of love and a card is like i would appreciate it so yeah but anyways i will see you guys in my next upload thank you guys so much for watching thank you for tuning in and don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel don't forget to hit on that post notification bell so that you can know when i upload new videos and i will talk to you guys in my next upload thank you again so much for watching bye